Dear Aquarius, we are using the six-card spread for your tarot reading for July. The first card of the spread is the moon. It reveals how you feel about yourself. You feel confused, vulnerable and full of doubts. However, all is not as it seems. Feel the fear and do it anyway, because all will turn out well. Expect the new and unexpected to show up and welcome it into your life. Your turbulent emotions are muddying the water so step back and try to find clarity of mind, no matter how difficult this proves to be. Things may seem tough or confusing but stick with it, it's right for you. The second card of the spread is the tower. It reveals what you want most right now. You're probably looking for an easy solution to a difficult problem. However in life, turmoil and upheaval often bring about positive change just not quite as we would like it. Seize this opportunity that is forcing change as a chance for a new beginning. The third card of the spread is temperance. It reveals your fears. You are afraid that this period of harmony in your relationship or life in general is not going to last. Perhaps you fear that a rival is going to cause conflict, or already has, threatening to upset the peace and tranquility you are enjoying. Any quarrels will be short-lived so just try and enjoy the moment for what it is. If life is not joyful and tranquil at the moment you may fear that it never will be, take heart and be patient and life will soon have a sense of normality again. The fourth card of the spread is the Hierophant. It reveals what is going for you. There is help at hand. Just ask for it. If you are concerned about making the right decision there is someone with the right moral fiber who can help. You can receive wise counsel and honest advice from a teacher, priest or parent, or just someone you have a lot of respect for. They are more than willing to help. The fifth card of the spread is the sun. It reveals what is going against you. You may experience a few delays on your quest for success and achievement but don't worry, you will get there in a blaze of glory. Success may go to your head a little, so a bit of modesty wouldn't go amiss. Other than a few minor delays, look forward to a period of joy and happiness. If you are experiencing problems with conceiving a baby, the sun often heralds good news around children and a much-wanted pregnancy or birth of a longed-for baby. The sixth card of the spread is the High Priestess. It reveals the likely outcome. Your intuitive powers are at their height at this moment in time. Only by listening carefully and trusting them completely can you embrace that power. Do this and you will make strong, clear, self-assured decisions. Allow for flexibility and expect promising outcomes. If you resonate with this reading, don't forget to subscribe. Dear Aquarius, in this reading we will also include your tarot card for this month, which is Ace of Wands. The Ace of Wands is an inventive creative card suggesting some sort of passionate union, positive new beginnings, or the birth of something powerful and inspiring yet to come in your life. It could be a new project or something creative that you will be taking on. What you need is at your convenience. Do not miss the golden opportunity. Engage yourself with new plans, actions and new experiences that you have on your work. Decide and undertake the necessary commitments. Don't waste valuable time. Do not wait or else you happen to be surpassed. Love and private life. If you are single, this can indicate the beginning of a new love relationship heading your way. Make yourself available for love in whatever way makes sense to you. If you are already committed, the ace tells you that the relationship is about to undergo a new beginning, and you will rise to new levels of understanding each other. Express yourself. Work and social life. If you are looking for a new position when the Ace of Wands appears, know that something new and very positive is likely to be headed your way soon. Be bold and ask for what you want or need in the work or career arena. You are likely to be more successful than you'd dream possible. Finances. The appearance of this card is usually the sign of a turn for the better in terms of fortune and wealth, and sometimes it can even indicate gifts of money or inheritance from unexpected sources, but it certainly doesn't mean that someone has to pass over for you to receive this inheritance, this gift does not have to be money of course, any kind of gift that has value to both the giver and the receiver can be indicated by the ace. Health. You will soon reach new, 
positive levels of health and vitality. This is an excellent time to begin a new health regime. Start where you are. If this means exercising for two minutes, or eating vegetables at one meal a week, then that's what you should do. The payoff for doing so will be huge. Don't delay. Spirituality. Remember that your mind and body are more closely linked than you tend to consider. One affects the other, without fail. This card can indicate a new spiritual influence coming into your life. Think about your spiritual role models. If you don't have one, find one. There is always help available, if you are open to it. 